Okay, hello guys, assalamualaikum. We meet again with Ombob. Okay, uh, okay, in this tutorial, I want uh root a pawn or place the custom ROM, but instead, <clears throat> I will sh share to you how to create a patch VB meta for Samsung Pawn. Okay, so maybe some of you guys thinking, uh, how to patch to VB Meta in Samsung Pond. Okay. If in other Pond like Xiaomi, we can patch it using a VB Meta command from the Facebook. Uh, but how to to disable the VB Meta in Samsung Pond? Okay, I will show you how. Okay, first thing you need to do is you need to install a uh, magis apk into the pawn okay it doesn't matter if the pawn has been rooted or not okay so i'll show you this tutorial uh i will show you how to do it using the samsung galaxy a20s okay let's i will show you this rom uh, sorry this one okay this is galaxy a20 <clears throat> okay where is so for information okay this is using the android 11 uh it doesn't matter can you cannot use any firmware so and see in here it's used the binary tree okay so you must have the same firmware like this one okay can see here build the build number is a twenty two zero seven f x x u three okay this one so let's close it and let's copy magis apk okay in here i have a uh, magis apk you can use the stable or canary one it's all the same okay let's put it in and create a folder so it will be more uh, more safety okay and let's back to the pond <clears throat> let's install the magic apk okay go to the internal storage and go to the folder where you have of your file okay it seems it doesn't show up okay let's copy to another folder so let's copy to the root folder so it can be more accessible okay where is it <laughs> ah sorry let's put it in the music folder maybe okay okay you can see right here i have a uh, magis apk and let's install it it is scannery base you can always use the stable one <clears throat> and let's open it right here you can see we have installed the apk but we haven't installed the magis so it's not a problem because we just need to patch it okay let's put down the pawn and let's switch screen again okay this is the step i will provide the step in the description box okay the first thing you need to do you, you need to know uh this firmware okay let's open it uh this is the firmware that i have uh, sorry this one as you can see it is the same firmware like in the pond a207 fxxsu3 okay 
x x two three uh is it okay binary three x x u three okay it's the same let's put down the pawn and and then you need to extract the files okay let's put it in here i already extract the files okay basically you just need the ap files right here and uh forgot the okay just the ap <laughs> okay just extract the ap file as here and i already extract that one open the ap file <clears throat> can see there is a boots.emg.lz4 and the fib meta okay let's track the boot image then the fib meta okay so we have two files and the next step is we need to compress the two files into the tar format okay <coughs> just open the 7 zip select the two files then select uh, right click just the 7 zip menu and add to archive okay this one and select the archive format to tar okay hit ok add and it will compress into a tar file that contain the two files the boot and vb meta okay so let's copy the tar files into the <clears throat> into the internal storage okay let's put it in here then let's switch the screen again let's open the menus uh, sorry the menus and seems that they just want us to get the apps okay just hit that okay as, as you know that while patching the file i just always wanted to use the newest file so you need to upgrade yeah i also will provide the link for the magic apk <clears throat> okay install let's open it again and here we go so we have the latest magic apk okay so for us to patch the file we just need to select the install menu right here okay and then uncheck recovery mode okay just hit next and use the second method select and patch the file and select the tar file that we have created using the <coughs> seven zip okay we have put it in the where is it music right here and this is our file and this is it let's go and it will pass with image and the vb meta Okay, you can see in there. It's repacking the booty mates. Maybe some of you guys will have a question why should I put the boot emits and the Phoebe meta, not just the Phoebe meta. Ah, uh, seems that you cannot do it, okay? <laughs> because you have to have the emits, okay? The images file. Maybe you said that the patch has been saved to the download folder. Okay, download slash magic patch. Okay, let's open it. 
Hmm, where is it? Uh, one lot. Okay. Okay, this one. Let's copy the file. And let's put it in here. And the next step is just need to extract the modify BB meta. Okay, this one. Uh, sorry, okay. I will rename the old file BB meta underscore old. And this is the BB meta that we have pets. Okay. So for you guys, uh, that need to press the VB meta image. You need to open the 7 zip again. Select the VB meta, select the 7 zip menu, and add to archive. Okay, and then select the format to tar. Hit OK. And here we go. Now we have a modify VB meta that has been patched with mages. Okay, guys. So, uh, okay, that's all. Okay, sometime in the newer version of Samsung, when you flash the VRP, you will get brick. And it said you need VB meta. Okay, basically, <coughs> it's the same like the Facebook command, like this one Facebook space dash dash disable verity. Uh, but because in Samsung we don't have Facebook, so we need to patch using the mages and then press the BB meta. Okay. I hope uh, this video helped you. If you feel that this video helped you, please give it a thumb. Okay. And I also have a last video about uh, custom ROM and phone routing, especially Samsung, Xiaomi, and Xiaomi, and etc. Please check my other video. Maybe some of the video will help you. Okay. Yeah, that's all. Thank you guys. Have a nice day. Stay healthy. Stay care. And wassalamualaikum.